Chicago police that there was in fact a fatality in that shooting. Turns out that victim is on life support. Um, so the initial report came out as one dead, four wounded. It, mm -hmm. it is technically five wounded, like you said. Um, so basically, shortly before 6 p.m., a uh, white four-door vehicle um, uh, drives to the intersection of uh, Wilson and Sheridan. Mm -hmm. They see a group of people standing um, in front of the Uptown Baptist Church where they were actually serving uh, dinner for the homeless at the time, or getting ready to, I should say. And <laughs> blood in, blood out. Police are investigating a drive-by shooting on Chicago's north side where six people were hit. This happened next to a strip mall at Sheridan and Lawrence in Uptown. The strip mall security guard says he kicked a group of young men off the property at least five times yesterday and warned them not to hang out or loiter because they could be targets. He says the youth replied that they had guns and were not worried about the violence. Dogs, uh. high city niggas got that dope boy magic. If you GVG, then your life is real trash. He's running, laughing. He got, he's shot in the arm. He's running past, laughing. He fell right over here behind the car. I go outside. Another guy laid out in front of the store. I job I warned a lot of people, but you know, they just one ear right out the other, you know. And now maybe people will start listening to me now. Okay, here we are, same corner, just about 45 minutes or an hour later, still no cops, none that I can see unless they're plain clothes. Dinner, or a uh, feeding program still going on over there it looks like, people milling around. There's an ambulance over there, at least they're prepared. I don't see anybody. Right there is where the shootings occurred. There were cops there yesterday on the left side of the road. There, and then there was one right there. Supposedly keeping us safe. This is a safe passage lane for kids to go to school because Stewart School got shut down. Blood in, blood 
down yep. Once you ain't with us, you never be the same Blood in, blood out I just saw, I, I got off the, uh, I got off at Argyle Red, I saw all the lights, so I'm like, I'm just going to jog down there and see what's going on, I didn't know that this was, mm -hmm. figured after college, you know, I'd move to the city, try to find a job out here, just, you know, move away from the suburban bubble, so to speak, and uh, I'm kind of regretting that decision now. When my landlord took me on a tour around here, uh, <laughs> the part I saw looked a lot different than what I'm seeing now. Some worrying signs ever since I moved up here, like most reputable looking folk ro roaming around, you know, subway stations, stuff like that, you know. Just people I'm not comfortable with, you know. Have you ever heard gunshots before? Or no, anything? no. Does it make you upset? Does it make you want to move? Or? Uh, definitely. Really? Definitely. Further south, Lincoln Park maybe, or back to the suburbs.